All right, welcome back traders. This is Tim with Irvin here. Welcome to another session. Today, we are gonna be reviewing our full week analysis that we did Saturday and Sunday. And kind of like showing you that our analysis so far has become very top notch. So uh, guys, I know you guys are here behind scene. If you guys wanna participate on the trading or you, or you, or you have any question, please interrupt me and let me and ask me live. We here with you anyway. Then I will release this video later on to the world. So first, you are my priority because I want you guys to make money first before anyone else. All right. So we are gonna be basically trading live, showing you what I did uh, on Saturday and Sunday, and probably you. Uh, today, hopefully everything makes sense. All right. All right. So we're going to go ahead and start with NCD. No, I, this is with the yesterday. So this is part of the training that we were doing yesterday. I don't know who asked me about this pair, but we're going to go ahead and start with silver. Look at what I told you guys on silver on Saturday, guys. This is freaking amazing, man. I told you guys the market was, ooh, I have it in black here. Let me go ahead and change this in white because the arrow you're not gonna be able to see it. Oops, let me delete both here. Look at what I told you guys on Sunday. I said the market still were gonna push up, retesting mid 63 to our 50 Fibonacci line. Perfect hit, guys, perfect. From there, I think yesterday when we were doing a live session, the market was sitting sandwiching, sandwiching here. And then look at what happened, boom. Perfect, guys. I said the market was gonna come back to our 23.6 Fibonacci line. Look at that week. Boom, it hit that area from there. And, and that was it. That's what I told you the market was gonna do in sober. I'm telling you, this analysis are top notch. Pay attention, also pay attention to, um, to the radar here. Everything is telling you the market is bearish. I'm telling you guys, if you have not made money on Euro USD, uh, uh, Euro GBP, all those are sell. Look only for sell. Look at what's going on. Boom, nice drop. And then the market will eventually recover, but you're here to make money. The money right now on this market is on the bearish position. That's my personal view. All right. So, Beth, if you guys have any questions, please ask me as we go. But or if anyone wants to participate on like on any of the uh, analysis that I already did, you're also more than welcome to do so. But pay attention on, on AUD USD. I called this one on Sunday and I told you that market was gonna be bearish all week. Unfortunately, uh, I think we did an analyze this one yesterday in a live session and the market was going sideways. And if I'm not mistaken, I think uh, Mr. Elliot ask something about this one and uh and it was just method of being patient and look at what happened boom market drop i didn't know when it was gonna drop but my prediction on this one was where look at this one <laughs> using our system is pretty cool guys look there was one one hit in there second hit is in here so my analysis on this one was like okay market has to come that way anyway right look at that perfect hit boom from there, market is gonna recover back, right? So here we see in the four hours in there, it has not closed. The market, in my opinion, still may drop more, coming probably like you know ten more pips below, touching this brothers and sisters here. Then market finally will be in a uh, PV position. But overall, in here, guys, overall we are supposed to be selling. AUD USD is only to be in a sell position. Unless if you're gonna scalp the market in a buy position, do it. But I don't recommend you on this particular trade here, don't look for buy position. Stick to the sell position, it's clean. Market is doing exactly what I told you guys on Sunday. Hopefully some of you guys did make pips on this one as well. All right, let's pay attention to another one. Let me know if you do have any questions. This is one of my favorite pairs. I did took this position here, and also I did took a position on Euro AUD. Look at that, I did it on, on sell, boom. Look, my prediction on this one was supposed to be on the 38.2 Fibonacci to admit 50 Fibonacci. Look at that, perfect guys, 
perfect. Of course, the market dropped more. I didn't know how far it was going to drop. But at least I give you an accurate information what the market was going to do. So in my opinion, since I didn't see no information previously, I thought it was going to uh, reverse from this particular uh, four hours here. But no, market came in and break the next level, which is this one here. You see that? Level one, level two. And that's exactly what happened. From level two, the market reversed back to what? Brothers and sisters in here, I will say, it just went a bit up, but still, right now, I don't even know what's the master trend on this one. But we're gonna take a look at it, because this is good, guys. It's really good to understand. Yes, market is bearish. bearish. Good. Market is bearish, you're right. This is gorgeous, man. Oh my God. So what in my, if I had to reanalyze this pair right now in real time, let me check what the daily is doing. Yeah, I will wait. Most likely it's gonna come to this level here, probably a few more pips. It's coming to an end. And then uh, most likely from there it will reverse back. Yeah. So yeah, it might come and read that's that 23.6 Fibonacci, but it's coming to a good area. Look at this one. This is what I was calling the other day. When you guys see this huge, massive engulfing candle, because the market is bearish. Uh, who said it was bearish? Who was that? That was me. Look, okay, look. That's that you you're right. So in this I've one, been watching this one. <laughs> say that again. I've been watching this one. Yeah, this is good. This is this is a good one to learn, to be honest. When when you the market is bearish, like you said. So and here is doing a PV, obviously. This PV is very strong. So when you see this huge engulfing candle here on the next candle, that means it's coming to an end, in my opinion. So in here, even if I would have put a position in there, I would have put 30, 40 pips, probably my stop loss would have been here, and I still would have been in it. So now all I can say is the market may come back and retest that 23 Fibonacci line in there. And then from there, what do you think is gonna happen in here? We should be looking here for a red arrow coming down. From there, boom, this is gonna be a nice drop. I think, oh yeah, the next drop it will be here on the 38.2 Fibonacci line. Still do a small PV and then finally next week it's gonna continue to be in a bearish position. And guys, uh, one reminder is on Friday, you are gonna start seeing a bunch of brand new uh, setups, including the uh, monthly setups. So don't end it on the trade right away. At least give it a, you know, by probably Tuesday, Wednesday next week, you should have a solid foundation by then to know if the market is still gonna probably uh, reverse back to whatever trend it is. But the market will be giving you a, a lot of new setup. So a new opportunity. If there is opportunity on the sell market, just be on the sell market. But don't look on the buy position. Even though if you, unless if you put your trailing stuff, but you are gonna start seeing a lot of amazing setups in here. Because in here, look at here, everything is, is ready to go, is, is formed here. We're just missing what? We're just missing the monthly here. So this one could be a potential bearish position, but the, the week has not closed yet. So we have to wait uh, another two more days, then officially we're gonna start seeing a lot of brand new uh, trend. Pay attention to that. That is good to know. But this one worked out pretty good. All right, let me show you the next one that I did. The next one was the USDCHF. I think Sarah took this position here. Look at this one, guys. This is freaking amazing. This is what, a buy position? Yeah, she said it was a buy position. Look, this is crazy. Clean. I told you guys the market was going to do this. Look at this one. I said Marco is gonna come back to our 23 Fibonacci line. I was reading these levels here. Level one, 
level two. Look at what happened. Boom. It came and attached your second level. And then same thing happens in here. Look, it came exhausted. This candle closed. The next candle was your ending uh, candles. So the third one, that's when the market dropped. Bear with me, guys. My wife is calling me to see what she wants. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm live. What's going on? Let me, send, let me send it to you, okay? Okay, talk to you in a minute then. All right, sorry about that, guys. But look, this is perfect, guys. And here, don't look for sales in here, guys. I mean, on this, I mean, I'm not, buy is, I'm not interested in a buy, but this is doing a PV. So from here, market, boom, can reverse back and then continue back down. And, and it's just, but the overall here is in a buy position. But this one was a great call. So far, we have done what? One, two, three. No, actually, the NCD Canadian was done yesterday. One, two, three, four trades. So out of four trade, we are 100%. That's it. How many do you need? Just one or two or all four? <laughs> My God, I don't know. Uh, let's pay attention to the next one. GBP USD, I love this pair as well. Look, this was perfect. And here, I would, in this one here, if you were to take a buy position, obviously I said the market in this one was gonna, uh, it was not ready yet to be in a buy position. So still it's gonna drop probably two, three more candle. I mean, they're not small, probably like 30, 40 pips. And from there, market was gonna do a what? A buy position. If you would have put your 30, 40 uh, trailing stop in here, the market would have take you out, but in a guaranteed pips. Look at that. Yeah, that, yeah that's 72 pips. This is crazy, guys. This is amazing. But the, your job, and, and uh, someone sent me a message on our chat room, guys, is um, a thing that I, I don't remember uh, what pair uh, he was taking. It was a male. And his, let's say for instance, his entry was here as a sell, right? So, and I saw that he, start, he had his stop losses. It was, still, it was still at the same location and all this area was already dropping. And oh, I saw that his TP was somewhere in here. So, and I immediately coming back and I say, hey, please remove your, uh, move your uh, trailing stop and secure some pips in case the market, rever the market reverse. Because look at what happened on this candle here, market reverse, it would most likely would have taken him out, but it would have taken him out and I guarantee pips because you don't want to be making all this hard work here for nothing and then market reverse or suddenly will go back up and put you a negative. We're not in that business for that. And what we're going to be doing tomorrow, Thursday, on the uh, on the new scalping method, guys, that you need to learn how to take money out of it. When you're in profit, your job is to secure money, secure, secure, secure. Don't be greedy and say, okay, I'm going to be here for so long because tomorrow it, it will help you tremendously. Look, I'm not lying today. Let me see if I can bring my spreadsheet because I'm very excited about what's coming tomorrow. Let me see if it's here. Where is my, right here. Okay, perfect. Look at what I banked today, guys. Today is Wednesday. You, you were here with me yesterday. Look, last week, it was $160. Today, a, actually it's more than $800. I'm not, missed, I'm not lying here. Let me check my scalping account. 815 but since i don't have 815 here the next level that i have is 820 so i still left it at 800 that's a damn pretty good look at that week scalping doing the method that i'm gonna show you tomorrow 1500 so far in three days that's a damn pretty good income man. time four weeks 6200 time 12 months seventy five thousand dollars Look, to last week on Thursday, I did $110. That means tomorrow I had to beat this guy. On Friday, I did 400. So previous Friday. So this coming Friday, I want to beat this $400. So that it, that's it. So let's say I, I, I run it up to $2,200. That's, that's pretty good, man. Yeah, but this is good. 
I know this will help you tomorrow. It, tomorrow's going to be exciting. <laughs> uh, all right. So this one was so, it was perfect. So let's go to the next one. The next one is the USD peso. If I'm not mistaken, I think uh, Eric, I think Eric took this one because he was commenting on this one. And Ali also took this one as well, if I'm not mistaken. Look at what I told you guys on Sunday. This is amazing. God, guys. But what is the overall in here? Is anyone trading this particular trade here? If so, let me know. Even if you make a mistake, I want to correct you now so you can get better off. Because in here, the market, to be honest, is only selling. It's not doing anything else. Look at that. Sell, 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 sell. So you should be looking only for sell. And that's where the money is. I'm telling you, man, money is on a sell position. But this was a PV. When I gave it to you guys on Sunday, this was doing a PV. I just saw, to be honest, I just saw this uh, arrow here. I said, okay, the market's still going to be in a buy position. I don't think this guy was ready there. And then the market was going to reverse back from the 60, no, actually, once it, from the 23.6 to our 38 Fibonacci line. Perfect hit. Pay attention to this one. Level one, all right? Level one level two so the market came into the let me close the door my wife just got here <clears throat> see level one level two perfect hit guys perfect and then from there i didn't know to be honest that this guy was gonna form in there i knew that we are selling what we look this is, if you would have put a trend line here, this one broke the trend line. So a lot of people are going, oh my goodness, this is a, it's in a buy position and they, they're going long. Oh, no, not you. You know the market is bearish. You should not be for a long time doing that PV if you are trading PV. But tomorrow, all this PV, you will make money, but you need to actually have a, a budget whatever, five, 10, 15, $20 per trade, take it, take it, take it. Easy to make $150, $200 a day. So freaking easy. All right. All right, so far, how many have we done? Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Look at that. Uh, you know what, what I'm forgetting guys? Cause I'm getting less question. I know everybody asked me about the previous, uh, uh form that i was helping now that when i put it what we are trading here they don't ask me that question anymore so we are trading because i'm gonna put this on, on youtube multiple time frame system all right perfect you guys have any questions so far if not i move on all right so pay attention to gold this is a very highly requested trade. Every week, someone say, hey, Irving, can you uh, analyze gold? Uh, I think they're asking me for NAS 100. So uh, I may do it, I may not. So I don't trade that one. So, but look at what gold is doing. Gold is freaking amazing. Look at this one. <laughs> oh my God. Look, I, I, I saw everyone, com uh, they were commenting on the chat room early this morning. Oh, uh, gold is dropping, blah, blah. Of course. Look at that. Look at what I said on Sunday. I said Saturday. This is Saturday or now. What I said on Saturday was the market was still going to be in a buy position. This guy, I think this guy was here. Look at that. Level one. I don't know what level it is. Level one. Look at that, boom, 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 boom. Perfect hit, guys. It's like I was drawing it like it meant to, like I knew it was for a fact it was gonna be there. I didn't know, but I think that was a, a, a prediction that it, it was, that it, I mean, I did it so freaking perfect. So this month of October, guys, not even one trade went against my analysis. Not even one. 
And look, even this copy method guy and trading on my phone, look, I'm banking. I got no red days. It's only green, 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 green. And all I want you guys is to make at least $125. That is what, 600 bucks a week, $1,200 every two weeks, $2,400 a month. That's pretty good income. That's what, like $45,000, $48,000 a year. Look at from here. I said from here, market was going to do what? It was going to come back and retest at 23 to our zero Fibonacci line. I was looking at this guy here. But look at here. All the radar here is telling us, hey, Urban, we all are selling. What do you want to do? A lot of people are going in a buy position. Don't be that person, please. Look at that huge engulfing. Boom. And then the market reverse. And then still bearish. So it came and retested this area here. So in my opinion, market still may do it more. Look, the, uh, oh, the candle is still here. So it has not closed uh, in a bullish position. So the market may drop continuously, drop more pips on it. And then uh, it will reverse. If it reverse, it will come here 23 to our 38 Fibonacci level one or level two. I will call this on level two. It's more, more touches in here. And then from there, boom, market will continue down. But this is perfect, guys. I saw that you guys were commenting on this one. This, If you guys did make money on this one, congratulations. But so far, I know they're winning trade. I took 10 trades, 11 trades, right? I forgot one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. All right, so 10 trades, four on Saturday and six on Sunday. You here with me, guys? I gave it to you guys on Saturday and Sunday. All you, your job is to go back to the system and see if any of this one will meet your requirement. If it does, you know, trade or your own risk. Don't over trade it and test it out. This is the whole month of October. This is like free signals, guys. <laughs> it's it's here. It's very very accurate. Uh, let's go to Euro GBP. This was my guy for this week. This was freaking awesome. Look, the market here, we all know the market is in a bearish position. Uh, yesterday, I think it was not ready here. It was not, it was not, it didn't drop that far. And I said, if I'm not mistaken, if uh, correct me if I'm making a mistake here, but I think yesterday I said the market may drop to this level here. That's what I draw this. Uh, line here and then look at what happened boom it came here and then it reversed back boom look i said the market was gonna reverse back to the 23 to our 38 fibonacci line look at this one guys it's like like a new for fact that it was gonna be there look at this boom 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 perfect hit and then what else did i say the market was gonna do well we know we are in a bearish position to be honest, I'm still on this one, guys, and a sell position because the market is sell. Let me see if I'm making pips. Uh, no, I'm negative uh, 10 cents. And Euro USD, I'm making uh, 38 bucks. That's it. That's all I have right now because this is I'm just checking on this copy method. But I'm minus 10 cents on this one. I mean, it's pretty simple. So, uh, and look, the market at uh, New York is about to close in the next half an hour. So we are gonna see uh, on the uh, Sydney, once Sydney open, in my opinion, may, may drop more, and then we'll reverse back up. Because look at here, right now we're doing a PV. Look at the candle close, the candle close as a PV. So I'm, I'm, as, as soon as I, you know, uh, Sydney come in and make me profit, I'm out. And then I will look for a better position later on. Maybe when the Tokyo open, Sydney and Tokyo open, then I will look and go go to sleep and w wake up in the morning in profit. This morning when I wake up, uh, um, I put a, a tray on the scalping method last night. And when I wake up, I think it was 140 bucks. And, and then I, I, I went out with my family in the morning and I was copying the market and then I bank 800 bucks. 
and I still own it on this one and Euro USD. From 140 went up to a uh, to 800 bucks. All right, so let's go to USD JPY. This guy is good too. This, I told you on this one, guys. I said the market was gonna do what? It was still gonna drop more. Oops, where's my tool? It dropped a little bit shy. Still, it's still fine. And then from there, I said the market was gonna come back and retest the 38 to our 23 Fibonacci line. It came to our 50 Fibonacci line. Look at that. Level one, level two, to level two. Uh, let me mute Elliot. Okay. Look, you can always pay attention to those levels, guys, because you know there are support and resistance. This support and resistance were there. So if if it break one, it will come come and touch the next level. And then from there, I didn't know the market from here. I thought the market was gonna continue back up. But look from level two, market drop, boom. And look, it did respect that this brothers and sister. One, level two, boom, market is, it, it dropped. And right now it's looking to continue a buck up. I, I don't know what's the trend on this guy, to be honest, I really don't know. Uh, if you know, I don't know, uh, it looks very weird on my chart, to be honest. Look at that. It's not line, it's, it didn't line up correctly. So now this is what is going to happen, guys. Pay attention what everything is telling us before the month ends, because we're still in October. Month is not over. Everyone is telling us, hey, Irvin, we are in a buy position. So, but this guy here, look at this one. This one is alone. And these two are completely separate. So they're not connected. So this is why it makes me very nervous. Let me see what Max says. What is the radar chart month arrow? Don't match. I'm, look, look, you need to understand what the master trend is, Mac, and then go from there. Cause this is just an indication. But sometimes they will, sometimes they won't. And you just need to know who you're gonna be trading with if you are gonna be in a bullish or bearish. But in my opinion, these two guys will uh, change place uh, in the next two to three days. They're all gonna move here. And now officially we're gonna have a uh, buy position. Now the question is, are you gonna be trading bullish or not? But I don't like it, but it's there. Let me read some of the question. Uh, hey, Mr. Irving? Yes, sir. Uh, on my sheet, uh, on, on my chart, when I go on the, uh, on the daily, it has a magic arrow and then the weekly and then the monthly. You think that's just my broker? Yes, uh, it could be. But this one, this one, I, I don't know. On this one, it'd be giving me a weird uh, setup since a couple of weeks back. And I was just fighting out because remember what I give the world guys is I give them every single movement what the market is doing. What I teach you guys behind scene is, is like stick to one, either if it's bullish or bearish, stick one way instead of going all the way. Don't get me wrong, this still works, but it's better. You are gonna be biting your nails if you go against the yeah. trend. Yeah, because it looks like it's a, a bearish. It is, in my opinion, to be honest, it is in a bearish position from the previous from the previous trend. Just look at look at clean telling us the market is bearish. It's yeah, I was just. Me, it's not telling me it's bullish. That's why this. That's what I'm saying. This guy here is fine, but these two confuse me because they're not lining up together. Yeah, yeah. I, I just thought I'd ask you just because you know. I don't know if my broker was acting weird or what. Yeah, <laughs> same here. So, but I, I, I bet. Look, everything is forming already, letting us know the market is gonna be in a buy position, right? So most likely it's gonna be right now. If it is, guys, basically you're gonna be grabbing this guy from the neck because it's gonna it's giving you a nice setup for next week. Next week, to be honest, this guy is gonna be bullish. All bullish. Where's level one? Level one, level two. I will call the next week. I will say the market is gonna come back and retest the 38 to our 50 Fibonacci line. 
I don't know what the previous brothers and sisters is in this location here, but most likely it's gonna come in there and then it's gonna come back and retest our 23 Fibonacci line. And then from there, boom, if, if all these guys are correct, then it will be in a buy position. That quick, look at how I did, I did the analysis. But I have to pay attention with the previous brothers and sisters. You know what, let's do it right now. Because that's the only way we can all learn. Yes, look at that. Uh, brothers, first brothers and sisters is in here. Uh, I don't know, know if there is more data. Right here. Ooh, this is nice. Look at here. Look at what the market is sitting right now. It's coming to an end. Uh, let's go to real time here. Look at this one. So this is what I this is what I think the market will do now. Right now, for the rest of the week, market is boom. It's gonna come to this level here, to that 23 Fibonacci line. I would say, from there, market will drop more to the same level, brothers and sister here, and then it's gonna make this stronger. It's gonna give us more dots in here, and then boom, market will be in a buy position. Pay attention to that one. But Friday, hopefully, everything is is good to go like that. We still have room to go up. But this is good. But look, guys, so far, none of our trade has gone against us. Everything has worked perfectly fine. Now, let's pay attention to Euro USD. And I did this one on, uh, on Monday as well. We reviewed it yesterday. It was Tuesday. I did this on Saturday. And then someone challenged me on, uh, to do it on Saturday. And on Monday, that's fine. And then we reviewed it yesterday as well. And today is the final prediction. Look, three days in a row, I, I analyzed this one. I told you on Sunday, the market here, we all know it's doing what? What do you think it's doing? Is it bullish or bearish? Bullish. bearish. No, it's bearish. 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 Yeah, 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 it's bearish, sorry, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did it even, I've got so many pips on that. Yeah, this one is good. It's very good, yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at this one. This. Oh, let me explain you this one. Then I go to real time. So we all know the market here is in a sell position. So if you make money, hopefully you guys make money on this one because this was the setup was so great that you couldn't let it go. Uh, so this is what I saw on Saturday. I saw brothers and sisters popping in here. So market was sitting in here. I think there was uh the what was a green arrow here? Someone said, Irving, why you are going against if the green arrow is in there? Look, it did respect it, that one. And then I knew that this question was the boss. Once they, this brothers and sister pop in, they stay there. They're very strong. Remember, they're two time frame, four hours and daily. And then from there, I said, Mark is going to come back and read this 23 to our 38 Fibonacci line. Perfect hit. From there, I knew what, brothers and sister. I say, okay, market is gonna reverse to this level here. Look at this one. It's like, oh my God, it was so freaking perfect. And then from there, boom, I say, market is gonna come back to our 50 Fibonacci level. Look, that's one, uh, the next level is here. A, a little bit shy, it's fine, perfect. Perfect setup, guys. I don't know how else I can describe this. This is amazing. Now, pay attention what the real time market is doing right now as we speak. So we are live here. What do you think this one? Look, this is what I was trying to show you on the previous example, because sometimes the candles don't close. Right now, this four hours here already closed on the candle. This candle here is over. So, and it still had room. So in my opinion, the market is still gonna drop a little bit more half. And because right now I'm on this trade here. So I'm gonna take this money here and the market most likely will reverse. Oops, I grabbed the wrong tool. The market will reverse back. And what is the next level? Yeah, most likely it's gonna reverse back between our 50 to our 38, more pips up. Then next week, the market is gonna be in a buy position. All this sell is game over guys game over 
Don't look for run right now for a sell. This is game over. Right now, the market is going to be in AA doing a PV. And we need to see more information until that PV. But this level here is pretty good, to be honest. Let me put the uh, line here, level here. Look at that. All this level here. Boom, 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 boom. They're all minor support and resistance, but it's uh, still, I will say the market still had room to go up. And here, it will take probably by Friday to, to get to this area. And then suddenly next week, market will continue in a very position. Pay attention what I'm gonna say next week. So far in here, look at what the daily and weekly standing as market is doing, it's in a sell. But this is good guys. Look, none, none of the trades that I gave you all this week went against our analysis. It's, it's, they work out pretty good. Guys, if you guys want me to analyze any of your future trading that you are gonna be doing, unfortunately on Saturday, I had to do, do it alone. But comment on the on any of the videos on on, on the same uh, on the Saturday videos, so like that uh, I can write down any of your pair and I, I will throw it on the Sunday video, because that's the only way that you also will learn whatever uh, you are planning to trade. Because I mean it is it's very simple, guys. All you gotta look to be honest is look who you are trading with, who is your master trend, look at your brothers and sisters, look and then pay attention to who it where is your real time for our time frame doing. And then that's it. You already determine everything. Everything. Now, if you are gonna be using, remember this is the Fibonacci. My levels, all these guys here are Fibonacci here. Either you can just go by by that if you don't use the Fibonacci levels, all these numbers here, or either you can just put it in your chart like that. It's fine. But you need, please learn how to take profit, guys. Don't stay on this one for so long, unless if you're going with the trend, it's fine. But always, always activate your trailing stop. Even if the market take you out in 10, 15, 20 bucks, trust me, it's, it's, it's money on the table. Don't let it, don't let it go by. Cause somebody else is gonna take it. Either Elliot, myself, Ali, anyway. <laughs> Someone else is gonna take it if you leave it on the table. So let's all make money together. So tomorrow we are gonna meet at 4 p.m. So we're gonna go a couple of examples. If you guys want me to bring any of your pairs uh, send me a message ahead of time so I can prepare the uh, material and come back to those because I want to keep it short, at least probably like no more than 25 minutes. So like that, you can go back and review as many times as you want. And, and then I'm going to lock that video to our membership, okay? Because uh, to be honest, it's good. That will make you money. Hey, Irv. Yes, sir. It's Elliot. How you doing? All right. How are you? I just wanted to say one thing to the YouTubers who are going to see this video um, about your system. We've had a totally successful 100% winning week. And this isn't the first time that's happened. Right. It, it, it's a system, you've developed a system that takes the confusion out of the market, which way it's going, the direction of the market, how to get in, how to get out. and you YouTubers out there, if you're not on board, I'm telling you, you want to make some money, get this system. That's all I wanted to say. That's good. No, thank you. Thank you. To be honest, I, I don't know if you guys saw uh, who was, I think it was Cara. She banked like 4000 4, or 2000 this week, if I'm not mistaken. I'm telling you, man, this is freaking amazing. Man. Uh, I, 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 yeah, it was Cam. Cam. Here she is. Let me show let me show it to the world. Look at look in here. Ah, oh, where did where do you go? Let me bring it here. Look at that. $2,608. Bam. And she has it seems like she has multiple trades in there, but we get to read only three out of probably I think that she had like probably six or seven, but still two thousand bucks. How much money do you need? It's, uh, it's like what Elliot says. Is come and join us if you want to join us. 
or compare whatever system you are using. If it's making you money, it's fine. Stay there. If not, you know, if you're not ready, we also have the uh, YouTube Go membership. There are some one-on-ones in there that you can pay attention. And uh, what we're going to be teaching you tomorrow is going to be locked in there as well. So that's what I want everyone in my team to come in and be on the class tomorrow. And write down, no, take picture on your phone, whatever you have to do, and then go back and implement that on Friday. Uh, don't try uh, passing 2 p.m. on each Friday. And because usually the market will slow down at 12 p.m. But believe me, uh, if you can make, you know, 30, 40 bucks on, on, on Friday, add it to whatever position you were you did dur during the week, it's still going to be good. But uh, so that's all I have, guys. So I will see you guys tomorrow at 4 p.m. Thank you again for coming in today. And um, so let's make the money together. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, let me see if I can find the, uh, the intro. <laughs> all right, guys. So thank you again. Okay. Thanks, Irvin. Wow. All right, how did I close this one? Stop sharing.